Where would you like to go, dude? Okay. So, next up. Spirit Internment. Oh, is this the largest execution site in the entire universe? Screams are often heard. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. So we're not on the, the last stage already. We're... There's probably like a good five. Darkfall Memories. Enter stage. idiocy is beyond saving we captured the lost but instead of making them give up the demon general's location you go and shoot them off shut your mouth you didn't even try to stop red magnus you were doing something so idiotic i was dumbstruck and forgot to stop you i am not to be blamed for this yeah right when you saw the firework go off you said my, how beautiful! Th that was... Cut it out. Anyway, it looks like the Lost have labeled us as rebels. That probably means they'll start coming to us. Not bad. <laughs> and just as I finish saying that, here they are. This battle shall decide if they are truly worth using. If they're defeated here, they're useless. I'll have no need for them. Alright! Red Magnus will super lay the crackdown on them. It's nice to see you're so enthusiastic, but there's one more thing you should watch out for. Is there a problematic enemy or something? Yeah, that sludge. That sludge has an evil tea that decreases the damage taken from non-elemental attacks. It'll be hard to hurt it. And sludges have high weapon resistances against fists, swords, and guns. Weapon resistance. All characters have resistances to weapons and elements. These are the resistances. The higher the number, the more resistant they are to those attacks. Negative numbers are bad. In this situation, fist, swords, and guns are really high. If you attack with a fist, sword, or gun, nearly half the damage will be decreased. With the evil tea, it'll take about one quarter. That's problematic. The Supreme One will just have to super overpower him. That's one solution. However, there's an easier way to defeat it. The Sludge has very low elemental resistances. If you attack with magic, like fire, its evil tea won't activate. So that means you should watch the resistances when you fight. That's right. Now let's go. Okay, so we've got uh, a lot of these guys. How much HP do these guys have? Not much. Now, can you still throw enemies off the let's edge go. of the screen? I don't actually remember that one. Okay, so first and foremost, let's do this. Uh, Grand Slam Man, how far can you go? There we go. Let's go. We're just going to send the uh, Grand Slam combo out for the time being. Oh. I forgot, he doesn't... You don't lift up the uh, Grand Slam Man. You just magic change it. Ready? Okay. I just like how intense he, he looks when he's got that listed. Trans Prin Barrage. Ooh! New ability! Nice! Okay, next up, Seraphina. Men are my servants. I might as well split up into two groups here. We'll just try barrage him down. We've got a mage come up ahead. Uh... Send Ryoko out this way. Leave Honestly, I'll probably have the whole party go this direction and just leave the uh, pretty blade master go in the other direction. Uh, I'll send the two muscle heads. That seems like a decent idea. Even though uh, Red Magnus kind of slow. Note to self: give him boots. Let's go. Trans Prin Barrage. Not actually a bad move. Doesn't kill the guy, but still. These guys have a lot more health than I remember them having. That's a problem. Special. I assume just Boulder Crush, not super useful? Yep, thought so. Okay, end turn. So here's the problem. Unfortunately, uh... At some point, we're gonna want to grind for levels here. Which I'm not super keen on. But still, Blade Rush learned. Hey! Oh, right, he's learning sword skills while we're at this. That's useful. So we might want to do... Uh, I don't know how I'm gonna do that. That might be the be uh, best kind of thing to leave for, like, later. Fortunately, so we could do... Oh, Rapid Arrow is a, uh, is a line skill. 
I didn't realize that. That's why it does so little damage. Okay. Let's see. Let's cancel her command. We're gonna move her over here. We're gonna move him forward. We're gonna try and do a combo attack to the best of my ability. And then we'll switch up to do some other things. He's pretty injured, though. So chances are the combo attack's probably gonna work. Okay. There we go. So that'll heal her up. I think full health? I'm not entirely sure. Either way, party attack! See, I like the party attacks. It means everybody else levels up. In fact, why is... Wow, he must be in, like, every single party attack, because he's already level 6. That's not a bad deal, though. Okay. I think I can keep doing that pretty, pretty blast. It costs a fair amount of SP, though. Or we could do Blade Rush. Let's see. We could do... The Pretty Barrage does a lot more damage, though. So I'm going to keep Pretty Barraging. Unfortunately, he's too slow, which is a bit obnoxious. Oh, well. Let's end this quick! Huh. Let me thank you. Should make Moax's super OP. Yeah. Okay, he'll be fine. Unfortunately, Moax's is, uh... Yeah, Mo Moax's ain't bad right now. Uh, the thing is, as far as, like, making a character particularly overpowered is a bit of a... bit of a headache. The way to do it is, um... You continually rebirth them into, like, the same class over and over and over again. And just every time you do it, it increases their HP. Unfortunately, uh, that happening is... I'm not going to say it's slow. Here, here's the question. Can you toss? We might as well throw Red Magnus for once. Because he's never going to be able to do anything if we just let him walk normally. Can you move the rest of the way? Yeah. Okay, might as well have them line up. Perfect. All right. Okay, so, wow, he does a lot of damage. Then again, his attack power is probably... Oh, no, actually, his, his is really high. But then again, he's wielding a full-on monster. Go figure. Wow, actually, OP... Moax is, does just shy of uh, Killian's, Killia's damage. I didn't even... I wasn't even paying attention to that. Then again, I did, did get him a really powerful uh, move. Is it a Fire Emblem Awakening type deal? Kind of... It's close, yeah. Okay, so you've got your revenge attack going. We might as well use you for something. Though, realistically, I'd like to use... Uh, how much damage did that do? Realistically, I'd like to use... Uh, realistically, I'd like to save him for... Let's see, so we want we want that one. I want to save him for the um for the slimes, but I think we're gonna be okay. Also, it looks like the slimes are gonna be attacking the uh dumb combo over there, so we might be in a bit of trouble. Oh well, we'll figure it out. Let's see. I guess I might as well start moving over there, see if I can get a hit in or two. Because it's gonna take a long time to take him out. Uh let's see. Yeah. Close enough. Huh? Let's Coming. do this. Okay. That was significantly less killing than I was expecting from that situation. Yeah, we should be okay. And she's learned Espoir, which is the, uh... Espoir is the... Oh, what's it called? It's the status effect removal skill, so this is barely gonna do damage. That's okay. So why don't we actually cancel that for a second? We're gonna wanna do... Oh, shoot, we don't have uh, Blade Rush anymore. And we can't do triple strike. Nuts. Alright. You know what? Chain rate. It's low, Let's but go. it's worth a shot. Yeah, there we go. Damage. Let's go. Okay. And not much, but we can at least take one out. Yeah, looks like Idiot Platoon will just be able to take out the slimes. Not so much, though. Do we get a counter counter? Yeah, we get a counter counter. Counter counters are the best. And his HP is definitely catching up to Red Magnus's. Then again, his levels. He's got two two levels on the other page. Oh, he, she didn't actually get an attack. Well, that's handy. Let's just nip this dude in the bud. 
Second like Ricardo. Oh hey, and we get the we get the uh, mage in the combo attack. I'm I'm trying to get the mage up just so the mage is not flimsy all the time. Okay, and that's the extent of that. Yeah, those guys will be fine. Maybe not. I don't know. We might lose Kilia here, but. Let me thank you. Phantom Blow learned. Ooh. Phantom Blow might actually be a sp elemental. Nope. No element. Not particularly good either. All right, we'll just smack him back a bit, and then we'll have uh, him move in here. Now he's got an axe. I don't think these guys take quarter damage from axe attacks, so that's actually pretty good. Okay. Then I should be able to move Mage Man into position. You're tall. Now here's the question. Can I do fire right there? Nope, can't. Okay, that'll be fine. I was kind of hoping I could uh, move the mage into position so I could, uh, or, you know, just preempt the spell location. Does not work that way. Bit of a shame. Doesn't matter that much. Let's just keep healing. And chances are she's not going to be able to shoot anybody from there. But she can lift. Not like it really matters that much here. Oh, we cancel that special. Now we do triple strike. There we go. Just reduces his defense. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're good to go. I think that Slimy's yeah, that's barely gonna do any damage. That's it. Triple strike. Does a fair amount. Nope, no dice. Oh well. End turn. They don't lose anybody. Ooh, he is almost dead. He almost dead. Uh, no big deal. I might as well have him uh, get the finishing blow with his spell anyway. Try and level up fire as much as possible. Even though it's not so it's not so useful. Uh just because you get upgrades to the fire spell later, you can kinda push it further along the way. Okay, we can nail bat. Ah, I have no idea how I'm ever gonna get up to uh nine combo bonus without geo squares. Oh well, doesn't matter that much. You okay? Okay. Let's see. Yep, figure the usual MVPs. Oh shoot. I wanted to take a look at the uh the victory screen, it actually looked more interesting than the usual ones. Or new. Oh well. It appears you are all relatively unscathed. It takes great brilliance to emerge from a battle that the lost in such fine condition. Who are you? Oh, please. There's no need to be so cautious. I am not your enemy. My name is Christo. Like you, I too fly the colors of revolt against the lost and demon emperor Void Dark. Ah, uh, he really isn't an enemy. How boring. You're such an idiot. Just because he claims he is not an enemy doesn't prove that he truly isn't our enemy. Huh? Why not? <laughs> you guys are funny. By the way, your fight back there was excellent. Your power took down the feared lost army. Especially you. You are the demon hero that I've been looking for. Me? A hero? Stop fooling around. Wait! Aren't you two being a little too familiar for guys you just met? In case you didn't know, Sir Kilia is mine. Oh, then pardon me. In that case, I shall offer to shake your hand as well. As a sign of friendship. That won't be necessary. I'm not some hussy who allows just any man to touch her skin. If you want to compare hand grip strength, step right up. Right hand or left hand. Take your pick. Well, that about does it for the greetings. Now let's move on to the main point. If you are fighting the lost, then you must know about the demon general, correct? Stop holding back. I'm sure you have some information about him, don't you? You are precisely correct. You have all seen just how rough spirit interment has become, right? It was completely destroyed. There is only one person who could have done that. One who is so powerful he is rumored to be one of the top demon generals. Demon General Bloodus. The one who is second in strength only to Void Dark? That Demon General Bloodus? 
Red Magnus says, just bring it! He would be such a perfect opponent! Red Magnus is trembling with excitement! Stop trying to act tough. If you two are so scared, then don't come. I can just go by myself. Who, who said the Supreme One was scared? Nothing scares Red Magnus! Trying to fight the Demon General without a plan? Why are men such imbeciles? <sighs> it's fine. I'll use them as a distraction while I assassinate Demon General Bloodis from his blind spot. Yes, that's the plan. <sighs> Please wait for me, Sir Kilia. <laughs> Instead of falling on their behinds at the thought of facing Demon General Bloodis, they're actually excited. They are useful. Everyone, please wait for me. I'll lead the way. The mysterious Christo became an ally. Okay, let's go heal, as usual. I kind of wish there was like a button on the main screen that let me heal, but I guess this confronts me with a lot of various options. Event. Oh, shoot, I guess I have to talk to Christo along the way. Okay. Oh, event means that these two want to talk to each other. It actually lists the characters that will be interacting. That's neat. Stare. What? What is it? Do I have something on my face? It's a million light years too soon for you to fool me. But what do you mean? Since I met you, I've always thought it was weird. You may have fooled Sir Kilia, who's kind, and that monkey, Red Magnus. But I won't be fooled. Uh, stop remaining silent. Why don't you say something? Could you be into boys' love? What? That friendly gesture you had with Sir Kilia, even though you had just met him. Not to mention how unusual it is to hold his hand. The whole situation. Christo is pointing squarely in the direction of B.L. Boom! No, no, no. I have absolutely no interest in that. Please stop right now. I am innocent. Is that so? I swear to g- I mean the devil. Hmm. Very well. But if you try to make advances on my Sir Kilia, I will kill you. Sir Kilia is my most valuable servant. Don't know why, but I'm scared, and I want to go home fast. Uh, for the record, I'm fairly certain Christo is is a uh, angel, hence his like different opinion and stuff like that. Oh well. Anyway, uh, let's see. I assume I have no quests I can turn in yet. Review quests, completed quests, don't sharpen nails. Unfortunately, a lot of these are kind of yeah, fighter rank three, mage three, brawler three. Ring, ring, ring. Most of these I can't get. So we've got one for the dried up wasteland. Blood parch, dried up wasteland. So we just have to go back and redo the first mission over again? That's weird. Okay, any of these particularly useful? Oh, it wants me to steal. Oh! If you want our help, just give us something. We'll accept you as an underling. Sure. Okay, so I can do Orc Pride easily. Conclude quest. Manual select. Let's see, where's the, uh... Where's the rotting garbage? Rotting garbage! Beautiful. Let's give the Orcs the rotting garbage. Alright. Did very well. You're shining today. Okay. So, Orcs can now be recruited. Okay, what else we got? Can't do that, can Oh wait, no, these are pending quests. What about quests I can accept? It's Master Special kill Skills, Strength and Stuff, Item Collection Rare Better, Trying to Cook Again. Okay. Well, we could do Trying to Cook Again and we get some more rotten garbage. Uh, let's see. Lockbox. Prinny kill a, kill a Prinny. She get an orb, paralyzing Mothman. We get stun. Guts. Clear stage any five times. Okay. So that's easy enough. Adors are scaring me. 
archers. Cannot accept any more quests. Okay, so let's let's abandon a quest or two. Uh, let's see. Let's abandon these. I'll go back and do them later. Uh, in fact, let's abandon a lot of these, like, you know, rank up ones, because I can get these along the way. And then pick them back up. So there's no reason for me to hold on to them. I'd rather get the ones that I can uh, progress with. Okay. Like Magical Warrior and stuff like that. Like, I will I will get them later. Okay, accept quests. So we want. Brawler Fighter for your rank. Okay, here we go. Item collection, any. Oh, that's for stealing. Special skill collection rate. I don't know how that works. I'll figure that one out later. Dried up. Yep, nope, don't know about that one. Trying to cook. That's for the rotten garbage. Lost army box. Kill one printy. You know what? I'll take it. Just because there's a decent chance I will fight a printy at some point. Physical attacking. Let's see. Kill no board. Doesn't the look of that lucky board piss you off? When I beat a lucky board who doesn't have a board, nothing happens. So it sucks. There's nothing worse. It's a high difficulty one. I don't know when I'm going to get that one. Kill anybody level above a certain level. Okay, so this is the quest I'll take for the time being. Okay, what else do we want to do here? Um, might as well take a look at our, at uh, our basic equipment. Welcome. Okay. Uh, let's see. Bye. So we could get. Yeah, we might as well get Killia some new gloves. Now here's the question. So Killy is really good with swords, but we keep giving him the pretty sword. He's good with, he's great with axes, kind of mediocre with everything else. I guess okay with spears and fists. We'll keep him on the axe man. Okay. Spears, we're not doing spears, axe. We could get a battle, battle gavel. Actually, you know what? Here's the question. What is he even using? He's using a nail bat. Aren't nail bats particularly bad? Yeah. Okay, so we'll get the... We'll just give him a battle gavel. And I'm too poor. I only have 100, 100 hell. Whoops. Oh, well. Let's fix you up. Let's see. Get treated. Is anybody even... Yep, everybody's injured. I was not paying attention to that one. I have no money left. That's okay. Most people aren't particularly injured anyway. Whoops. There goes all my, all my money. Save menu. Might as well just keep creating new saves. This is just in case I have to go back because I missed some. Nah, I don't even. I don't even know. I'll probably just go to a single save after this one, because who cares? I don't. I don't know how big the saves are either. Where would you like to go, dude? So we are mildly injured because I. Uh, I've. I forgot to go heal first. Whoopsie. I guess we got a healer. May I have a moment? I would like to get to know you all better. Would you mind if we reintroduced ourselves? My name is Christo. For reasons that do not concern you, it is my duty to assassinate Demon Emperor Void Dark. I am Red Magnus, the super famous overlord of Scorching Flame! Huh? The overlord of Scorching Flame? Yes, Scorching Flame, the netherworld known for its savage, sweaty, muscle-brained men. Whoa, whoa, whoa! We have women there, too! But the savage, sweaty, muscle brain part is true. Let's get back on topic. I am Serafina, the Overlord of Gorgeous. The netherworld that is said to be the richest in all the three worlds? Yeah, she's the famous shrew princess of Gorgeous. Th this is surprising. They're bigger fish than I expected. And which famous netherworld would you be the overlord of? None. I'm just a wanderer. So, which netherworld are you from? Oh, me? You speak quite elegantly, so you must be a noble or royal of a renowned netherworld, correct? Of course. In fact, I am also an overlord. I cannot elaborate much, but I will tell you that I am the overlord of a certain giant netherworld. Let's just leave it at that. Certain giant? Sounds super strong! Yes, it is super strong. In fact, there are numerous stronger overlords who rank above me. 
Wow, there are people above overlords? Certain giant must be a really big netherworld! The netherworld I am affiliated with deems demon emperor Void Dark to be dangerous. Hence, I was ordered to assassinate him. A large-scale netherworld? Could it be Roaring Rampant, Brutal Beast, or Dragon Fang? <laughs> I am affiliated with an even greater world. The overlord of a certain giant nether world join your party. Is there a problem? No, it's nothing. I was just thinking that this many overlords coincidentally gathering together is too good to be true. <laughs> yes, I feel exactly the same. Sir Kilia, shall we gauge Christo's skill now? I need to evaluate whether he is a worthy man for me. That's great! Red Magnus is super excited to see how strong the overlord of certain giant is! E excuse me. I'm much better at planning battle strategies than actually fighting. Is he the overlord of the Dark Void? Nope! He is most definitely, uh, he is most definitely an angel. There's got to be an angelic character, and he, he has to let's be go. one of them. Okay, so let's take a look at, let's take a look at things for a second. So we have nothing on blue. That's movement plus one. That's movement plus one. Allied boost plus 50%. Movement plus one. Movement plus one. Clear. So the problem is we need to leave one of these things let's go. alive to do anything proper. Oh, well. We'll just kick the shit out of everything else and probably lose a lot of people in the process, but it's worth it. Plus, losing guys doesn't actually uh, screw me over in the grand pro process of anything. It's kind of nice, actually. Okay. I'm gonna eat you, dude. So we'll bring Grand Slam Man with, because he's he's some kind of wizard. Uh, let's see. And we'll have to leave uh, Red Magnus in the very back. My main goal is to get to the very end. Pop that, uh, popping all of these things down onto the tiles. Pop this one down, and then bust this one, which will be a Red Magnus, um... It'll be a Red Magnus task, just because he actually does a fair amount of damage. Okay. And she's got a fair amount of SP... SP's all... Uh, heals all good. Let's see, do I want to... Uh, <laughs> who's particularly injured here? Nobody is. Oh. And we'll bring... What's he good at? Oh, he's also a healer. Good! I needed more of them. Let's see. He also has bow skills, too. Interesting. Oh, it doesn't matter too much. So she's healing... I want to say she's healing the mage. So let's execute. Yep, there we go. Perfect. I'll support you. Okay, there's going to be a bit of a slow process, but still. And I'm not going to do a whole lot of tossing just to keep the entire group as a... Oh, really? Pick him up. Throw him. You should be able to just nuke that one slime from orbit. Yep, there he goes. Okay. Let's see. So if I send uh, if I send Grand Slam over here, we can at the very least do the uh, we can at the very least do the the sword move, which is always really effective. Yeah, dude. I love that freaking sword though. It looks so good. Really dumb, but you know what? I like that. Okay, special. Ooh. I want to say that... Nope, that doesn't do a whole lot of damage. None of these are going to do a whole lot of damage, are they? Well, trans pin, pin barrage. Yep. Probably starting to hit the point where I'm going to want to look into uh, power leveling. Unfortunately. Okay. Now, is that a staff? How how does he have a bow move if he's a staff user? Nah, I'm, I'm not going to question it. Can she attack? She can attack that one. Uh, I'm just going to lift him up and chuck him up. Who knows what kind of 
business he can get into. Oh wow, he's actually got quite a lot of range. Wait, can he, can he even do that? I actually don't know. Whatever. We've also got Richard here. I don't know what Richard's gonna do. Oh hey, Magic Chain Montas. We can totally Montas uh, Arrow Chick up here. I don't know if this is a good idea or not, but we can do it. Okay, this is gonna be a bit of a mess. Let's go. Cripes, this one really doesn't take damage. From anything. Okay. For my master. <laughs> now chat is calling me out for my uh, lack of properly naming characters. Yeah. Or their their proper gender. It doesn't help that everybody looks feminine. Freaking anime. Yahoo, dude! Okay. Well, we've only got one slime left. At least on this line, so we don't have to worry about it too much. Okay. If we do it this way, this should... wipe him out. And if not, we got a bunch of uh, combo characters to work with along the way. Let's just go for the squirt. Uh, let's see. He might as well stand here. We'll just do. We'll just keep doing heal heal moves. Characters are getting kind of injured anyway, but I mean that's mostly my fault for just not healing them before we even left town. That was that was dumb of me. That was dumb of me. Okay, execute. Perfect. Are you ready? And this should be good enough. Now, is that a three-person combo? Are you ready? I haven't actually seen... Wait, he's surfing on his... <laughs> I haven't seen a three-man combo like that before. He just surfs on his friends. That's kind of great, also kind of dumb. I love it. Okay, perfect. A little bit of injury here and there. Did he just level up or did he actually take a hit? He must have just leveled up, because I can't imagine he would have taken any more damage along the way here. Okay, cool. Since when can my mage move so much? I don't know why. Alright. Potato, you are a confusing dude. This is good. Oh. That's actually really handy that she she just uh went into rage mode. Because that means all of her heals are cheap. So we can heal him, heal him. How much of a waste of SP is that? Oh no, we've got plenty of SP in this situation. And that's not going to quite kill him. This will take out Head Wound. He was on a move plus one Geo. Yeah! Okay. That's why he had so much move. You are correct on that one. I kind of forgot. Okay. We have more slimes. I hate slimes. Okay, so why don't we why don't we move her up here and chuck the mage forward? Because we're going to need him on the next one. Unfortunately, he doesn't have a very good AoE yet. So we're kind of at uh, Swordman's Mercy. Or not Swordman, um, Slime's Mercy. I got plenty of healing, though, so that's pretty good. So does he have a... He has a... He has a... So he just has a bow. Okay. I thought for a second he had a staff, but guess I'm wrong. Oh! You know what? You can have both! I didn't even think about this. So you can have a, a main weapon and a sub-weapon along the way. That's how it works. That's why you can use both bow moves, bow moves and sword moves. I didn't even think about that. That's really good, actually. That's real good. Luckily, the slimes can't uh, damage Killy at all. So it's kind of like a... It's like, on one hand... Yeah, I can't hurt them. On the other hand, does not matter. Let's see. Oh, shoot. Well... Yeah, I'm gonna keep the novice skull healed for the time being. She'll just move forward and heal the archer. Perfect. Because, yeah, I've... I. That must have been, that must be a feature in one of the newer Disgaea games, but since the last one I played was Disgaea 2, which is pretty much mechanically a clone of Disgaea 1, there's not 
don't know, there's a lot of features that I don't know about that keep showing up. Oh. Ha. I'll support you. <laughs> I'm probably gonna kill my entire party by geo clearing here. Actually, you know what? No, I'll probably be fine. If I'm if I center them all on these tiles, we should be okay. And we can just have uh, Kilia run in for the last one. Perfect. Okay. Uh, you know what? Can you move any further? Nope. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna end turn. Oh, right. Uh, for every tile we move move onto one of these, we get a movement speed bonus, and we're an ally bonus. I like it. I should have the range to. He's out of SP, isn't he? Well, that's a problem. Probably should have thought about that. Cures all ailments, recovers SP. There we go. We can move forward, but that'd be meaningless. I really need to get another character with elemental skills. Otherwise, we're going to have some very hard combat against these green slimes. Uh, oh. He actually takes more damage from axes. Stave of attacks and monster stuff. Okay, that's good to know. I will keep that in mind. So we might as well move Kilia forward. It's not like he's going to be taking any damage. He is rough and tumble. What's his defense versus his? Ah, they're pretty close. Okay, so Moaxis is generally going to be in a good spot. Uh, let's see. Yeah, I, for I forgot the non-healing thing also applies to SP, which is particularly rough, and you don't get it back, like in uh, Final Fantasy Tactics. So that's, I'd say bad, but it really, it doesn't matter that much. I'll keep her in the back. She takes damage, so ask him a question. Unfortunately, my one axe guy is standing back in reserve for the time being. She might actually get hit here. We're not even going to be able to do damage. Oh, we could just kill Richard right now. That that would be bad. Well, I'm just going to keep wasting Rapid Arrow on him, whether or not it I'll does any you. damage. Hey. It at least levels up the skill. Okay, anything else I can do? Special... Triple Strike Phantom Blow. Nope. Okay, you know what? What if I... What if I just throw him forward? He's not going to do a whole lot of damage, but he might do some. There we go. Let's go. Might as well use Triple Strike to just peg him down a little bit. And can she even... Can she hit him from here? Hey, she can. Not going to do much damage, but could be worse, right? Okay. Yep, didn't do any damage. Oh, well. And now we got friends. Oh, Bow Girl is 100% dead. Yep. Counter, counter, counter. Counter, counter, counter. Coming. The best. Okay, so first and foremost, where is Mage Man? We need you on the battlefield. Stat. Please be able... Please have the range. Yeah! Okay. He's gotten some extra range lately. Not lined up good for me, unfortunately. Oh, well. Triple strike anyway. Ooh, that is going to do a lot of damage. Let's see what else I can... What else can I do here? Might as well do some healing. Is anybody else even injured? Doesn't look like it. Alright, well, that's easy enough. And then all that leaves is the imp, so I can just have uh, Kilia run forward uh, with a massive movement speed bonus that we're going to be running with here. Right there. Right so if I just there. toss it right there, beautiful. I'll just have Richard, for some mysterious reason, stay in the group. I don't even understand. But it doesn't matter now, does it? You lose. Let me thank you. Exploding Tiger learn. Ooh! Is Exploding Tiger the... It's the good fist move. I've forgotten. Okay. Enemy turn. Doesn't matter. Alright. Uh, so we're gonna have... We're gonna have Kilia start blitzing forward. He'll be okay against the last crew. He's also in revenge mode. So I might as well make as much use of that as possible. All of these guys go forward. They probably won't kill this guy. How much longer do... Oh, they only have revenge mode for one more turn. Ah, eh, whatever. Let's see, why don't we... Great. Why don't we lift and throw huh. him? He might as well You're pick tall. this one up. Throw it down here. 
We might as well get as many bonuses stacked as possible and get the entire party off of the tiles if I can. Because this is going to hurt when we clear. It's going to hurt real bad. But that's kind of the beauty of it all. Uh, he's got a turn. I might as well have these guys as a backup, just in case we don't kill them. Oh, here comes the imps. Here I go. Here I go. He's got a pretty good resistance. So yeah, he's not going to take any damage. Alright. Go, go, kill ya. Please run very fast. Okay, so we got to weather one more turn. Should be his... Oh, you know what? I could have tossed him. Oh, well. I don't know if he's going to survive this one. Does it matter? Not really. Uh, let's see. He'll just he'll just sit there fighting. We'll have B team down there. Okay. Wow, he actually can insta give a uh, imp. Good to know. Okay, that's that's the extent of what I can do. End turn. Let's just hope he. Okay, right. He just keeps casting stuff, so it doesn't matter. Okay. I actually forgot forgot that Earth skills were even a thing. Let's go. In this game. Okay. All of this work. Finally, let's get down here. Your Red Magnus. Reckless. He might die from this. So what would I do? Nope, can't do Grand Slam Man. Grand Slam Man does not have... Uh... Alright, whatever. Let's see, Allied Boost and Execute. Alright. Yeah, we might, we might lose him from this. This is going to be an expensive... Expensive, uh, clear. But it's totally w worthwhile. Yeah! Oh, this is gonna be fun. I love- I, I love the, uh, counter system in this game. Uh, the- the Geo cubes, whatever business. Don't think it's actually gonna kill the imp, actually. I don't think it's gonna do enough damage. Oh, well. Say- oh, no, it- it combos up damage. He just took 40. Unfortunately, it goes so fast, I can't actually see how much damage the imp takes. Yeah, we might lose him. Yeah, we're gonna lose him. Oh, well. Let those tiles turn. Yeah, he, he's gone after this one. Oh, well. Let's just bask in all of those sweet, sweet items we're gonna get at the end of the screen. Yep, he is Dunsky. Oh, well. Does it count as killing an ally when he kills himself Geocat clear? Probably not. Magician stick. Okay, this is the one I want to look at here. Whoa, that's a cool looking demon knight, dude. I like it. Also, another wrestling guy. I wonder I wonder if we actually get the uh the the dude of throwing or if he's he was just flavor for that one level. I don't know. It'd be cool if you got him as a flavor character. And I also get a lot of money for it, too. Yay! Skip the demo. Hell no. Never doing that. That just ain't my Excellent. style. Excellent, especially you, Kilia. Your magic potential is beyond expectations. It's hard to believe you're an ordinary demon. Magic potential? What are you talking about? Oh, don't worry about it. I was merely thinking out loud. By the way, many demons have given in to Void Dark. Why are you all fighting against him? Let's see. Suffice it to say, I'm doing it for revenge, I think. Was I not born a princess? With my elegance, beauty, and riches, I was peacefully enjoying my celebrity lifestyle. However, my father arranged a marriage of convenience and ruined everything. That is how I ended up running away from home. That is why I would like to exact vengeance against Void Dark, who took away my freedom and luxuries. You're an overlord, but you ran away. Hmm. I've never heard of that before. What part of that is getting vengeance? Seriously, as a matter of fact, isn't Void Dark the victim in this case? Ha! You're not gonna shoot Red Magnus that easily! What is your reason for fighting, Red Magnus? My reason? The Super lay the crackdown on Void Dark! and become the strongest overlord! 
that's Red Magnus's reason for fighting! What about you, Sir Kilia? I know you're out to defeat Void Dark, but you must have a deeper reason, correct? I... It's none of your concern. But I... will kill Void Dark. What a murderous aura! He must have a lot of hatred. That powerful hatred is Sir Kilia's driving force. I see, I see. It seems that you all have quite a lot of history with Void Dark. We all have different reasons, but our goals are the same. Let's unite as one and defeat Void Dark together! Let's go!